interesting things are happening now with regard to uh, my since since l not just I've been I gave up on the idea of free will months ago, if not a year more and more ago. Um, but actually believing it is a new thing. Like it's about three weeks now, and yesterday, <clears throat> just I'm, I marched through my day. Just the word is aloof, aloof and disconnected not disengaged i was doing all my duty but i was like i was like you know it's like a, a kid on um you know they're in a, like a like a, a little okay in the back of the car back in the old days there was a, a thing you could put in the back of the car with the kids to st fake steering wheel and the kid feels like they're driving and you know they'd be dad or mom would be up there driving usually dad in my day and um, the kid would be back there in their car seat or whatever with their fake steering wheel. <clears throat> That's how much of what I do is, has before I gave up the idea of free will, before I began to believe it, that, that free will is an illusion. And now I have my hands off the wheel. It doesn't mean I'm disconnected. It's a strange thing. The car still drives itself. I still do all the things I do. I still, I still address the things that are important to me. I still attend to to what I need to. I, I still engage. I still do my work. In fact, I do my work even better now. But I'm my hands are off the wheel. My hands are folded in my lap. And that's what it was like all day yesterday, out and about with my wife, doing our shopping and uh, having lunch together. I was <clears throat> disconnected. doesn't mean I... And, and I do speak less. I find that that's the case as well. I genuinely, I've become more stoic in my in my verbiage, my, my utterances. I'm... I, I speak more when I'm spoken to, less filling of the time, less active, pretending. And it's a good feeling. It's a strange thing for sure, but I like it. <laughs>